Welcome back everybody, we are back for another tutorial. In today's video, we are going to design this landing page with an interesting scroll effect. Here you can see I've already prepared all the assets and I will leave it to you in the Figma file. So now we just start with two pages, one with a sky background bar with just a simple nav bar. So first take your image and press P to create a vector, which you'll later use to mask out the wine bottle in the image. Now make a copy and mask out the other part of the image. Place your image on the frame and create a rectangle on top of it. Add this color and change its opacity to 43. Add the heading and the other's details of the pages. It's already done. We can focus on the second page now. First, create a rectangle the size you want. Mine is 950 times 1172. Add a stroke and change its fill. Let's focus of the scrolling shop now. Create another rectangle with 500 as a width and 950 for height. Add one wine bottle and place it as you like. From now, the design is up to you. When you're done, Make one for each bottle and group everything. Place it on the second frame and make sure it's under the big rectangle. Let's add the title. Place them one under another, group them, and create a rectangle which you will use to make a group. Do the same thing for the description part. Once you're done, complete the design of the page with the assets. And don't forget to add the next button. Once everything is set up, add the shop page under the main page and make three copies. On the first one, drag everything out and change their opacity to zero. And on the image, make some rotation and change their position a little bit to give this movement, this pouring wine effect. On the second page, just change some element of the shop page, such as dragging some part down and up and don't forget the opacity. Now on the third page, select everything from the first page, except the nav bar and slide them up. 
make sure to do some additional changes on the image so the rest of the hand won't show up on the frame. Once you've done that, you can slide up the shop page, but we are not done yet. Make a copy of this page and make the wine group slide to the left. Slide the tile group and the description group too. You should end up with something like that. And do the same process for each bottle. Then we can now go to the prototype part, and you already know the drill. We link the first to the second with an after delay, Smart Animate Gentle 4000. We link the Discover Here button to the third page with an on click, Smart Animate Gentle 2000. But for the next button we link them with, you guess it the next page and the last one with the first one. And we do the on click smart animate ease in and out back 1500. And there you go. Enjoy.